from Bonnie. She's a friend of yours. Yeah, as, as soon as I saw the lightning strike on the radar, I texted her and I said, do you hear thunder? And she said, yes. So I said, P can you grab us some video? So she <laughs> and her kids went outside. We have to say hi to Jordan and Kendall. They're watching. Hi, Jordan and Kendall. They helped Bonnie get that video. So yes, they're not only just hearing thunder, but they're seeing lightning. And so we're going to continuous, uh, continually see a lot of this energy right now, really pushing through or, uh, Orange County and the IE. So right now, the system is not over. We're looking at a lot of instability, and that's because that low pressure system to the north of us is drawing in this subtropical moisture from Mexico, creating all of this energy. So I'll get to our forecast in just a moment. Let's take a look really quick with our weather watchers. A few of you have all uh, signed up and also want to be part of our weather team. You can still do so by going to our website. Steve telling us it's rainy, 53 degrees where he's at. We're also getting Zach from San Juan Capistrano telling us it's 68 degrees and also rainy. And he's also measured so far about uh, one one hundredths of an inch of rain. So this system is not going to pack a punch for a lot of folks, but again, it will bring uh, some, some significant rainfall to a lot of the higher elevations. But take a look right now. This is a live look at our chopper over Laverne. So Sky 2 flying overhead, really catching what's happening right now. So we are looking at a lot of the steady rain and also, again, light showery activity to, depending on where you live. And then you can see with the radar, really detecting the lightning and then also the thunder. So remember the old saying, when thunder rolls, head indoors because we're going to see lightning associated with it. So we are looking at a lot of this going on again with that instability coming in from Mexico and it looks like it will continue to stay like this at least for another hour or so. So right now we're looking at a nice size rain cell sitting over just to the north of Norco really affecting your drive through the 15 as you're headed up to Mira Loma and then off to the east in Fontana. Earlier there was also a nice rain cell sitting over the area. It looks like it's dried up but again we're looking at on again off again showers and now we're finally seeing some activity in areas like Pasadena, just a little bit north of Alhambra, and then a little farther south uh, in South LA and in near Inglewood. We're also looking at some light rain, some sprinkles being squeezed out of the clouds. So the scattered showers actually will continue with us through tomorrow morning. We're going to see anywhere from a tenth of an inch or less for some of our coastal communities, and again, a little bit more for the mountains and foothills, about a quarter inch to half an inch. And then later this week, we're looking at more rain activity, more widespread rain as we head into Thursday and Friday. Out the door right now, temperatures in a mix of 70s and also 60s. By the time we head into tomorrow morning, it's still going to be cool. It's still going to be cloudy. And again, we're gonna, still going to see some showers until the afternoon once the system lifts out of the area. Then we start to dry up just a little bit as we head into the middle of the week. And then by the time we head into Thursday, you can see another low pressure system coming in from the south could potentially bring us a lot more rain. Again, this is something we have to continue to monitor. Hopefully it stays together and brings us about that quarter inch or maybe half an inch of rain. Overnight low 61 degrees and then tomorrow again below average. 76 for Reseda, 72 for Gardena, 78 for Chino Hills, 70 for Dana Point, low 80s for Riverside and Lake Elsinore, and then extended outlook shows. Again, another chance for rain late Thursday into Friday. And Peter and Elsa, we're crossing our fingers that we do get that second chance for rain. Back to you.